Elsewhere in this video playlist, I have videos showing you how to attach a spout. Um, and what I found was really difficult actually was finding uh, videos showing you how to make a spout. So um, it is possible to make a pinch spout much the same way that we made pinch other things. I'm gonna pinch all the way through, all the way through so I have a tube here. And um, I'm being a little fast and loose here. Uh, as, you've, as you've heard me say before, I think one of the fun things about pinching is that you can be fast and loose. Um, I'm going to add some clay up here and I'm basically just making a tall, uh, tall cylinder out of, sorry, uh, out of the pinch um, materials, out of the pinching methods. And I can refine this once I kind of get it roughed in. So right now it's a bit of a mess. Um, I'm cleaning up the inside with my finger. Um, I, I share a video uh, for some, the first video in this playlist, uh, the artist is very careful and clean and smooth and what you don't see is all the time she put into that. <clears throat> so when you see a video that's pretty fast on the internet, you know that either that person is doing it a little sloppier than they normally do, or they're cutting out some of the steps, or they are um, so, they've done it so many times that they can speed it up for you. <clears throat> or a combination of all those things. So I am just using my paddle to kind of shape the outside of this. And then this is a fairly fat um, uh, spout, but I could then attach, I need to clean up the edge, I would cut it, but I could attach something like that. Another way you might approach this is you might take, um, start from a solid piece, and you're gonna work this kind of into a short, fat uh, spout shape, but it's solid right now. <clears throat> And then you simply, this is just a you know paperish end, it's a rubber tip end technically, but just a wooden stick of some sort. And you're gonna press that into there. And that is now got an opening there. You can roll it a little um, to stretch it out so that this is gonna stretch out. Be careful because it's gonna stretch based on where you put the pressure. So if you put more pressure on one side than the other. And that is a real fast way to make a smooth, simple form um, that I can then attach as a spout to this one. I can attach as a handle. Obviously I don't have a lid on this one yet, but I could. And um, I've got other people or other videos where me or someone else, we attach these well. And so watch them if you are doing spouts. Um, there's a video later on that talks about placement. Uh, don't put your spouts down here, essentially, is what it says. <clears throat>